Um, you know, it's funny. I still haven't quite watched the footage yet. Um, I guess it was for the first few weeks pretty full gas and it was all anyone was talking about particularly in town because Drone is a small town and I was having to talk about it every day pretty much and it was a topic of conversation and even now everyone when they haven't seen me in a while it's sort of the first thing that comes up which is natural because the way I crashed wasn't very natural um, it was a bit extraordinary um, but yeah still haven't watched the footage but um, that's the next step actually and how do you think it might make you feel? Um, I think now it should be okay. I'm not one to go on YouTube crashes because I think it's bad karma. But, um, yeah, it would be interesting to just look at it for myself and then decide because um, I'm still trying to decide in my head if I want to take legal action um, against the man. Um, I'd really like a formal apology. That would be pretty nice. And what injuries did you sustain? I um, broke my clavicle in two places. Um, it actually was like this close to being a compound fracture piercing through the skin. So it was a bad break, but um, I went to Hamburg Hospital straight after pretty much. Um, my team, DS, drove me there and the chief of surgery for the hospital performed the surgery. And I think that's why I bounced back so quickly and he just did an amazing job. And how are you feeling now? Are you back on form and looking forward to the race? I'm so pumped to be in California. Um, uh, America is where I started out uh, in 2012, so I love coming back every year, and it's just good to be back amongst my peers.